to remove the lamp and the housing units, you need to remove this 10 millimeter bolts. So you can use a, a deep socket like this, or you use a spanner, open-ended or ring spanner to do this. But you can say the, the rod here fixed with the lamp uh, body, and there the white uh, uh, bracket, and is one side against the, the body of the lamp, and the other leg against the, the metal opening. So that way is uh, holding the lamp lens in the position. So we need to remove this 10 millimeter nuts. So now we have released this, so you can remove the nut and the bracket together out. So you can see there is the uh, slot over there, so you can see the slot. These brackets actually get into the slot like this when you install. So just remember the position and uh, the tip part will be against the uh, metal body and the higher part will be against this uh, uh, lamp body. So after you remove the nut and the bracket, so the lamp can be removed by uh, pushing it up. So we have, yeah, there, there is a clip from the lamp body uh, clipped to the side of the tailgate. So we can remove that. So this is a, a lamp removed. So we have the bulb holder and one bulb. There's the socket uh, for the wiring. And this is the lamp. So the lamp, even we have two places for a bulb, but the bulb holder only have one bulb installed. And you can see that's a white lens. And this is for reversing. And that should be for the fog. So for this car, the fog light on the left is empty in the blank so there's no fog light on the left and uh, here is the post for the uh, bracket and the nuts so there the slot for this uh, white thing to slot in like this when you install it and here is the edge to clip to the edge of the tailgate so this is how to remove the bulb holder, the lens from the tailgate for a Turing E46 BMW.